So, welcome back to part 3 of my Let's Play Castlevania Dracula X and I have no lives left but I might be able to beat the boss this time so let's see how it goes. So, if you've come back from part 2 I thank you because part 2 it was a fucking disaster. But at least I learned. At least I learned uh, a bit how to beat this boss. If there is any strategy involved. Definitely a strategy. Kill it. Okay. Let's do this! Let's do this! It's time to kick ass and lose lives and I'm all our more lives. Okay. Oh, that's a good technique. Oh, how many how many hits did I get there? Concentrate, Zach. You're not over. It's not over. Don't fuck it up this time. Oh, I thought he wasn't going to die. Shit, I nearly got hit then. How lucky was that? Oh my god, I done it. <laughs> dun, 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 that was lucky. I don't think I should even attempt stage three without just having a full set of lives, so I might just kill myself. Oh, I can't believe I've done that. Wow. Stage three. Are we in, we're in the castle already? What kind of music's that? No. Bloody tears! Oh my god, that's brilliant. That is fantastic. Bloody Tears, classic Castlevania tune. How can you not love Bloody Tears? Oh, and and it's good. It's not a crappy version. Oh, it is a good. It is a good mix. Okay. This stage doesn't look that bad. Hmm. I'm gonna have to get past that. Oh, lucky I went the right way there. Oh, oh, oh! I didn't, hit, I didn't get killed there. Fine. Okay. Oh, what was that noise? Yeah, I got an extra life. I don't know what, what score you have to get to get the extra life. But uh, I've definitely got an extra life there. Let's make it count, hey. Try and discover the level as much as I can. Well, okay, let's not make it count. <laughs> so, what score am I? 20,500, 20, so maybe about 20,000, I'm guessing. Yeah, probably about 20,000, 19,000. You get yeah, every 19,000 points, you can get an extra life. That is good to know, although I don't think I'll be getting too many of those. These Medusas... See what I said about the Medusas in part 2? I said they're one of my... Oh, did I say that in part 1? They're one of my most hated enemies in Castlevania games. See how they change pattern? No. Hit him at the right spot. Oh, that that was that was a great play. Oh, that was cool. Oh, I had a feeling. I saw it was a different colour, and I thought it was going to fall, 
but um Okay they're gone. Shit, lucky I don't die first time on those. Oh not those again, I hate those enemies. Oh, if you're going to do that, I'm not... I think they just lured me into a trap then. How could I not hit you? How am I supposed to get him anyway? Someone enlighten me, please. How am I supposed to do that? Okay, okay. No. That is fucking impossible. That was impossible. How fair was that anyway? Come on. Okay, that's done. So the big heart gives you five hearts in total and the small ones only give you one. Okay. No, I think I'm gonna go this way. Fuck. Three lives. Three lives. Uh, uh, if I remember correctly, I think you do get like four lives in the other Castlevania games. Oh, maybe not. Maybe I'm... Maybe it's not true. But I actually do, I do, I do think it was four lives though. Three lives does seem a little tight. Ooh. I heard that in um, Castlevania 3 when you get to Dracula and you die and you lose your lives, you have to do the whole stage again. Because normally in the Castlevania game you get to Dracula and uh, if you die you can, they just, Start you right off where you where you left him where you left off. Sorry. So I hope if if I do get to Dracula, that there is the option. There's a checkpoint. If the, if I have to restart the stage every time, I don't know what I'm gonna do. I'm actually like shitting myself. <laughs> stage two was hell. We got there in the end though. Okay, so I'm going to beat him to the... No, he's got me in the same place. No, I beat him. Oh, that was good. He didn't even give me one hit. What are those in the background? Knights? They look like knights. I thought they... They look like um, the Egyptian god Anubis, if he's a god. That's what it reminded me of, with the pointy ears. But no, I think they're knights. Oh, pork chop. Nice. Oh, yeah. Stopwatch. I wonder how, if it's any good. No, it's shit. It just slows down time. In um, in the NES version, that's the invincibility potion there. What I just picked up. In the NES version, um, the stopwatch actually freezes time. But it didn't, it didn't work in the bosses. But I think it's the same sort of concept, but just only in that ring. It's kind of weird. Fuck! How did I manage that? How did I manage that? Well, I don't, I don't, I'm not even bothered about the, um, the stopwatch. It doesn't seem that good. Okay, yay! Wow, luck! Oh, I've got that back behind me. Wow, it really reminds me from the stage in, um, what's it called, yeah, Castlevania, the first game, in stage four, when you drop down and you're, you're in a section like this, exactly like that. Oh, that was nice. Time my hit well. Oh, it's about. 
Don't rush. Nice. Oh! <laughs> that was douchey. That was gay. I'm doing all right. I'm doing all right. Surprisingly, this stage doesn't seem as hard as stage two was. Or maybe it is. Maybe, um, thing is, uh, I'm trying to think. Because basically there's like four screens in there. Like every time I pass this, when I pass this section of the game, I'll come to a checkpoint when I die. Oh. So I think there's like normally like three to four checkpoints in each stage. So I've mostly seen most of the stage I'm guessing. So it doesn't look that bad. It's all about the boss. See, I was doing absolutely fine until I opened my mouth and started talking properly. <laughs> Ah, I don't know. I've got one there. I wonder if um, Ghouls and Ghosts is on Wii U Virtual Console. If it is, I think I might buy it. Because I'm a big fan of that game. Because I have the, uh, is it called Super? No, not Super Ghouls. It's um, I think just Ghouls and Ghosts for the Gen Mega Drive. I have the original cart for that. But I think there is a NES version and a Super Nintendo version. Maybe there's a Super Nintendo version on the Virtual Console. I have to check. Yeah, that's the thing. If you jump on the stairs, you'll fall straight through. A problem that took. Uh, until Symphony of the Night to fix, I think. I think in Symphony of the Night, there's no, you ain't got that problem. If you jump on the stairs, you just fall back on the stairs. I'm probably wrong, like I normally am. Whoa. Nearly did what I did last time. Try not to. Oh! <laughs> How was that even fair? Oh my god. See, what annoys me with Castlevania games, if you die on silly things like I'm doing now, because if you think of it, I've just practically died on silly things. That's how anyone will die on a Castlevania game. Just stupid things will make you die. A lot of people said that the uh, first Castlevania game was the like the most hardest Castlevania, one of the most hardest actually in the series. It's definitely a hard game, I'd say, but you know, as you can see, I'm not a really good gamer at all. I'm not good at, I'm not brilliant at Castlevania games. I wouldn't say I'm terrible, but I'm not anywhere good. But Castlevania 1, I didn't have a lot of problems with it, to be honest. I mean, once you find out about the Holy Water, yeah, technically it is a bit cheating. But I only actually found out about the Holy Water when I was fighting death. After that, I didn't know. And I don't think, and it's not a very long game, like most NES games are. But old games are about difficulty, and that's about it. Oh, something here. I won up. Oh my god. 
If I if my checkpoint's always here, I might not have to restart this stage. If that one one up always appears. That's cool. I was lucky there. That's what you call luck. Lucky I looked at uh, lucky I looked at that um that wall. Hmm. What happened was I jumped. Whoa. Stage four? Oh my god, what luck was that? You guys are probably going to think, right, he knew that. He checked that up on the internet. That was absolutely pure fucking random. How did I not know? Oh my god. What, what I was going to say was, I jumped and the flame hit me. When the flame hit me, I jumped. And that's what, and I, back, I bounced back, oh my god, and I found a port to stage 4! Well that's, that's luck. that's lucky. Someone wants me to finish this let's play. So let's go stage 4 then. <laughs> what luck. Oh, I can't believe that. I absolutely can't believe that. I'm, I'm not, do I die if I go down there? Wow, I found an extra life, and I found a port to stage, stage 4. Oh, you don't die. Sort of. You sort of don't die. There's yeah, that this mod's in um Super Castlevania 4. Well, that's lucky. I tell you what, if I um if I do get past stage four, if I, if I do beat the game, I will go back to stage three and do the boss. Cause you know, technically cheating. <laughs> It was pure luck, wow. I wish it would have took me straight to Dracula. Oh, uh, that's asking too much, but wow. Can't believe I'm at stage four already. I think most of you guys, like I said, you're gonna think, I, you're gonna probably think that I knew that, but I swear I didn't, that was absolutely random. 100% random. Okay, you seem mean. The blue knight, I prefer the blue knight. The blue knight don't charge at me like some rapist. I thought they would break those here. I don't think they're going to break. Yeah, they do. <laughs> Why did I do that? <laughs> Oh, okay. That was a bit mean. That was uncalled for. Can't believe I'm at stage four. How many times I gotta say that? Seriously, that was lucky. Whoa, where did you come from? I told you I hate bats. I hate bats in Castle Rain games. Hmm. Whoa, pork chop. Oh, oh, wait, wait, wait. I'm the master. That was epic. That was epic. Whoa, fucking hell. Shit. What is that? He's big. He's a big bastard. Look at that. How many hits you take? Mate, are you a boss? Core. No, no. That was uncalled for. That was quite rude, actually. Oh, I hate these bastards. They're, those are my most hated enemy. You can actually lose your whole life bar on one of these. Oh, yeah, of course. How was that even fair? Alright, you know what? I'm going to end the video here. So, if you've watched my Let's Play up to this point, I really thank you very much. Um, so, we're going to see you guys next time. Tune in to part four.